Good morning. It's been a while since I picked up the camera. Okay, yeah, it's been a while since I picked up the camera. Um, okay, there we go. That's better. So today's Saturday. It is 8.40 in the morning. Um, it's going to be a long and busy day. Nothing new has really been going on. Um, just working and my sister is still here. Um, so yeah, we haven't really done anything crazy. Just, you know, going out here and there to get some food, quick meals, met up with a friend of hers. Um, so nothing, nothing special. Like I said, this trip wasn't a, um, wasn't one of those trips. So that's why we're not doing much so today is actually going to be a long day because we're going to be driving to Atlanta from Dallas it's about a 12 hour drive I'm tired already because I hate being in a car more than four hours anything over four hours I'm just like put me on a flight I hate being on the road but the dog is too big oh by the way his name is Barry Barrington so we call him Barry it's my sister's dog whatever um, so Barry is too big to take on the flight and airlines are not doing cargo right now like cargo pets so we have to fly I mean, so we have to drive. Why? I just said we have to. Yeah, so yeah, we have to drive. Um, so yeah, we'll probably do it in two days. So we're going to start today, probably like around noon, because we have to go pick up a car. And then drive as much as we can, and then we'll stop somewhere overnight. And then finish up tomorrow. That's the plan. Um, we'll probably end up doing like eight hours today because eight hours is nothing for real for real so we'll see we'll see we're not gonna try to like overdo it because it's not like we have anything to rush to hurry up to get back to on Sunday so yeah so we're gonna drive into Atlanta and then I'll probably fly back to Dallas on on Tuesday um, Tuesday morning cuz um, like I said I'm I'm just going to help her with this drive and a dog like I don't need to spend like the entire because at first I was gonna spend the entire week there but I don't need to I have a lot of stuff to get back to here got a lot of stuff to do so really just a quick trip so just packing a couple of things and then we're gonna hit the road right now I am on my way to get a little bit of gas because I just don't like coming back to a car on E. So I'm going to go get a little bit of gas and then go get a wax. Today I was supposed to get a facial too, so today was definitely going to be a great self care day but change of plans. But it's awesome being an adult to be able to cancel, reschedule and do it, you know have your schedule pretty open and free to just do whatever whenever so that's what it's looking like and as you can see my hair is out I just got I don't know y'all I'm just I don't know what to do with my hair I've never been a hair person I hate doing my hair um, I hate paying somebody to do my hair I don't know so I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with my hair I don't know if I want to I don't know if I want to get a sew-in. I don't know if I want to just keep it in twists. I don't know if I want to dread my hair. I have no idea. I'm trying to figure that out. So in the meantime, it's out like this. I'll probably I'll probably wear it like this for a while, just wearing it out and just in its natural state for a while. So yeah but i'll pick up the camera later and check back in with you 
well, probably when we get on the road and we get, you know, get our groove going on the road. So, hey guys, so we're back much later in the day, still Saturday. It is six o'clock. We are in Louisiana. Um, I can't tell you which city because we have no idea. Just driving. So we still have about eight and a half, nine hours left to um, till we get to Atlanta. So ah, chewing my dad on cord. So the dog is um, interesting. He gets car sick. Um, but, you know, we're doing the best that we can. What else? He has so much room. So yeah, like this is his little haven, right? But instead, he wants to lay right here at my feet. That's it. That's where he want to be. So, probably won't get back on tonight because it's about to get dark. So, yeah, that's all. Check in later. Bye. Hey, vlog. Hey, YouTube. Yes, Elena, I'm also trying to record. Sorry. <laughs> hey, YouTube. Good morning. Today is, I guess I'll start the vlog off today. So today is Tuesday, March 8th, almost 4 a.m. I am heading to Atlanta airport to fly home. Um, my flight's at 6 a.m. So it's very early. So ready to go home. Um, so yeah. So I'm heading. I know I'll pick up the camera when I land. Um, and that's it. You'll hear the dog in the background. He's locked up. I just said my goodbyes. Me and Barry, we bonded for a little bit. All this gray hair doesn't really matter. Good morning. Much later in the morning. Not really. What time is it? It's 8.04 Central Time. Uh, made it back home. So glad to be back home. I'm tired. There's so much on my to-do list. Thing number one. Actually, I kind of already did thing number one. Turn on the pool. <laughs> Bring in the coffee table. I had a coffee table that was delivered yesterday. So, I uh, brought that in. So my next thing to do is wash my floors. So I'm gonna sweep my floors and wash my floors. Um, and then I wanna put my rugs back down. Um, I picked all my rugs up while the dog was here. And so I wanna get, you know, my home back to being homey, light some candles. Pretty much do like a Sunday reset on a Tuesday. <laughs> Cause it just needs to be done. I need to, um, I pulled the sheets off my bed before I left. so. I need to, you know, straighten up my bedroom, all of that. It's literally a Sunday reset. So guys, I've already swept my floors, dry mopped my floors, and wet mopped my floors, and I put the rug down, and now I'm putting together my coffee table. All right, guys, it's so much later in the day. Here's the coffee table. I'm not sure if I like it because of the TV stand is so light, and then this is like really dark. It's not too, too bad from the floors, but I don't know if I like these two together. Here's the overall picture. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about the coffee table. Hmm. Yeah, it took me forever to put this table together. It took me because 
I kept putting things on the wrong way, backwards, upside down. The instructions were not the best. So it took me a while. I had to take screws out maybe two or three times and turn them the right way. Um, so yeah, still haven't made it into my bedroom or my guest room to do my floors, to change my sheets, to still haven't made it in there. Um, I've just been busy between the coffee table and, a, and work, of course. So right now I'm starving. So I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna eat for dinner and then get back to cleaning and organizing and just feeling at home. And I wanna do a facial mask tonight before bed, so I'll do that. Uh, might do a nice hot bubble bath too. Oh, I'm so looking forward to getting in the bed. So I'm gonna go, like I said, get some food, clean up my room. Um, I probably won't wash the floors in my guest room until tomorrow, cause I just, I'm just really tired. At least I swept in there. So at least started that off. Normally what I would do is I'll sweep, then I'll take the Swiss, the Swiffer, the dry pads, and then go over what I just swept, and then I'll use the wet pads. Um, so yeah, that's simply what I do. So since I have to do all three and I've already swept, I still have to do the other two steps. So that's something like I may not do those two steps tonight before bed. I really don't even know what time it is. Okay, it's just about six o'clock, it's 5.56. So yeah, that's me for the rest of the night. I'll probably pick up the camera tomorrow. Maybe we'll see tomorrow we're back on the routine, back in the gym, um, back to hard work. So, bye. Hey guys, so today's Thursday. It is 2.38. Y'all, I left out of the house this morning at 5 a.m. Go to the gym, right? I had an appointment at Honda at 7.30 a.m. I get there at seven. Hold on. Okay. Got to the Honda dealership at seven. They didn't finish with my car until um, 2.05 is when the guy was like, oh, we're ready for you. So I've been sitting at Honda from 7 a.m. To 205. Starving. Did not know it was going to take this long to do my car. They do not have a shuttle service anymore. It was no point in taking an Uber because that's probably going to be like 30 bucks one way. 30. Mm -mm. So luckily I had my computer with me and I was able to work. So finally, home, well, <laughs> here's the funny part. I was like, by the time I order food, they're going to tell me if my car is ready. Sure enough. Or ordered the food, got the food. The food came, it was like 2.01. Like I said, the guy said at 2.05, oh, we're ready for you. Your, your car is ready. I had three tater tots and a piece of a nugget when he told me it's ready. So that was frustrating. Now I'm home. I have this poof in my hair. I've never put my hair up like this, but it needed some type of control. Um, supposed to get my hair done on Saturday. Looking forward to that. Trying to, I'm trying to contact the lady. I made the appointment on Style C. I called the lady this morning. I emailed her maybe about an hour ago. Still haven't heard anything back. Um, I guess my last resort is just driving up there. And that's if the address that I have is correct because I've never been to this lady. So we'll see how that goes. Um, so hopefully she gets back in contact with me. Like I said, it's almost three o'clock. I have a meeting. Um, and then I'll be done with my meetings for the day. And I'll just chill. Like, cause I'm tired. And keep in mind, I came from the gym. So I haven't been home to shower, get ready, nothing. And then to set me even more off. Yeah, I'm, for some reason I'm re-watching every episode of Girlfriends. I did that like two years ago when it first got on Netflix. But I guess I felt like doing it again. Anyway. Keep in mind that when I went to Honda, I came straight from the gym. So I haven't even been home to freshen up and do everything. But 
I'm too hungry right now to stop eating. I'm gonna finish eating. Um, listen to this meeting. I don't have to speak in the meeting, but I do want to pay attention to what's going on. And then I can shower and all of that. Didn't have a protein shake. Every, my day has been jacked up. Tomorrow's Friday. Thank God for Friday, right? So I'll pick the camera back up probably tomorrow. Probably won't be today. Probably will be tomorrow. May not be until Saturday um, because we do have some weekend activities to get into. So uh, just needed to rant about that. See ya. Good morning, YouTube. Today's Saturday, March 12th. I know we're all over the place in this vlog, but it's okay. This will be the last day for this vlog. I really don't know how many days I've been vlogging um, for this, but I just figured we'll make this the last day. It's a Saturday. We'll just start over tomorrow. Um, so it's 7.30, a little after 7.30. I'm supposed to be getting my hair done today. That's why it looks like this. All my grays are out. But um figured I'll pick up the camera. I've been up for a while. I've gotten a head start on my Sunday reset day only because I knew I had a lot to clean. So yeah, I got a head start on my Sunday reset day. Clean, uh, well, wash the dishes. One thing about me, I don't like using dishwashers. I feel like they don't really get your dishes clean. So I hand wash dishes. It's the worst chore of all time. So yeah, did that this morning. Um, cleaned up a little bit in my room. I need to wash clothes. So I'll do that tomorrow. Um, I'm gonna straighten up a little bit in my living room too, cause it, it's looking crazy right now. Um, it looks like I don't even work from home. Why does my house look a mess? Like I'm not here all day. Anyway, so I was supposed to be getting my hair done this morning. Um, also supposed to be going um, to celebrate St. Patrick's Day. So a lot of activities going on. So that's what we're about to do. My appointment's at nine. And the, the girl who's gonna do my hair, she doesn't live that far from me. She's in Irving, um, so it's not that far. So yeah, I just figured I'll pick up the camera and at least get this last day <laughs> noted. So, see ya. So I'm just sitting here um, editing. I don't know if it's this vlog or the week before that vlog. Y'all, I am so behind on vlogging, on releasing the vlogs because I keep getting these, you know, full storage messages so I have to like keep going through and deleting um stuff that's been on my computer for a while like old files and and picture messages and all of that so every time I run into that error it's like I don't even want to do anything because I know it's going to take a while for me to fix the problem um and so everything like relating to videos vlogs all of that is saved to my external hard drive but yet still I keep getting these messages. So yeah. So that's what I'm doing, sitting here watching Girlfriends again. I don't know why I decided to start watching every episode of a Girlfriends. Like I didn't just do this, what, two years ago, I think, when the pandemic started. And when they put Girlfriends on Netflix, I watched every episode. So I don't know why I'm doing it again, but it is just, it's so relatable and it's disturbing how relatable this is. <laughs> even though I'm not 29 definitely older than that how they how old they were supposed to be but it's uh scary relatable as far as and when I say relatable I don't mean like the girlfriends aspect I mean the dating aspect the oh my goodness I'm 29 and I thought my life would be different I thought I would be married by now and all of this and dating these different guys that all have their different issues in addition to dealing with my own issues and why things aren't working out that's why why this is like disturbingly relatable so yeah so i'm just sitting here doing that editing and um it's not quite eight i just put some bacon in the oven because i'm starving figured i'll at least eat um before going to get my hair done so Hey guys, later in the morning, still Saturday. This sun is messing up the, the lighting, so I don't know if you can see me. Got my hair did, DFW hair boss. She did my hair, this is my first time going to her. I really love it, really like it. It's a closure, so in. 
um, no glue, all sewn in. So I really like it. I am on my way to Costco. I'm, I was supposed to be at the parade this morning, but it's cold. It was too cold and I knew I was getting my hair done. So whatever, whatever. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make my way to Dallas um, in a little bit. I'm gonna go to Costco. Get, I need to get some, a few things from there. Um, get some gas, of course. And then, um, then I'm gonna go home, change, and then make my way down into Dallas, either Lower Greenville, downtown area, whatever. Celebrate St. Patrick's Day. My gas light just came on. It's okay, baby. We're on our way. Do y'all talk to y'all cars? I talked to her. Her name Posh. Posh is eight years old. I think she eight. I got her in thirteen. She a thir she yeah, I got her in 2013. So yeah, that's the plan. I'll meet up with some folks later. I'm just thankful that my hair is dead, cause baby. About time, right? So I'll pick up the camera in a little bit. See you. Hey guys. It's a little bit later. I got on my <clears throat> St. Patrick's Day gear. All green. I decided not to wear my green shoes. I just have on some black boots. So hopefully I can last a while in these shoes because I think we're going to be dipping and dodging and moving or whatever. It is 1.30. Kind of late. Um, the concert ends at like 5. So I'm sure people are just going to be out for a while. And it's, it's warmed up. It's like 52 degrees or so. So it's a nice sunny day here in the Dallas area. Um, so I'm meeting up with my cousin, um, getting some Thai food. I feel like I've been eating Thai food like once a week for the past like three weeks. I don't never eat this much Thai food, but I like Thai food, so no complaints. First, I'm going to stop and get some hookah tips. So I got my hookah with me. We're supposed to um, meet up with some other friends later this evening. Um, so that's why I have my hookah with me. I, I probably should buy another flavor. She should too. Maybe not. I don't know. We'll see. So, yeah, I got on my little hat. The hat is actually for Mardi Gras. And I didn't realize it until I got home from the dollar store. <laughs> but I think it's so cute. So, I just added it with my little headband. So, the only thing is, it's I'm going to have glitter everywhere. I already feel it. I already know it's on my eyes. It's on my face. Ugh. But, um... But yeah, so headed into the city to have a good time. Looking cute, feeling cute, smelling good. Let's go. <laughs> Irresistible, irresistible. I need you to give me your I want to be